You have to pretend like you like doing this. Come on. Yeah. How'd that one? That one came it. Nice. Keep still. See, if you're gonna get blue paint on you, this is how to get it. <laughs> I think with prostate cancer, for a lot of men, it's a difficult subject, and they try and avoid it as long as possible. It's good to raise our kids to know that those checkups are just absolutely part of life and no big deal. It's if, you, if you grow up knowing that from your childhood, you're much more likely to just routinely make those appointments from the right age, you know? Well, it is a kind of generational thing, you know, yeah. like from my generation, it's not something you ever really ever, it's not like you sit around with your mates at the, at the pub discussing, yeah, I just had a finger stuck right, but you know, it's yeah. just not having that conversation. But girls do. Uh, you know, we girls sit around and we talk about, did you get your pap smear, your breast check? You know, it's something that you just routinely know to do. It's a good idea to kind of like get that culture, to yeah. get that culture and to get that kind of acceptance of that this is part of, you know, your, your health routine yeah. as a man to go in and, and take care of that stuff. It's great that everybody's kind of getting together um, from every different walk of life um, to create a, a higher awareness of this. I preferred to have the blue applied by, you know, my wife's lips, which is, as long as the blue's on there, it doesn't matter how it gets there. And this is probably the most enjoyable way to have it done.